Hi, my name is John from ProWrestling.net. I'm here with uh, Zoe Stark from NXT. Uh, glad to interview you. Uh, you're in the four, uh, it's a five-way women's championship match tomorrow? Six-way. Six-way. Yes. Can't the mess that one up. It is six-way. Of course. Zoe so Stark, Roxanne, Gigi Dahl, and Lyra. So uh, what, are, what are your thoughts going into that? How, 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 like, almost like this, how do you feel at this point of your NXT career? Oh, man, I'm so excited. And um, by the way, it's also Indy Hartwell. Mm -hmm. So we got all six of them, right? All great competitors inside that ring. I'm very excited. But and here's the, and the reason I talk about NXT career. So um, I remember you got signed by WWE, yeah. like Tuesday. Mm -hmm. Did they put you on TV like the, the next NXT after you got signed? Immediately. Yeah. So Immediately. how did that come to be? <clears throat> so I uh, did the Dusty Cup with, on uh, 205 Live. And that's where uh, Shawn Michaels and Triple H saw my potential and yeah. then right there it was just hitting the ground running it was time to go oh awesome so, yeah so uh, here's the thing so you uh, work both as a like a good guy and a bad guy mm -hmm. um, and both seem to pan out real which one do you have more fun doing I love being the bad guy yeah I can say what's on my mind and I feel bad about <laughs> it whatsoever it's amazing yeah and uh, so everyone's always talked so highly about you and you know I mean of course you, being humble is great, yeah. but uh, what uh, what do you think they see in you that like that everyone is saying that is that intangible? Uh, they finally see something that I've seen my whole life, mm. right? Like I've known that I was born to do this, and I'm supposed to not supposed. I'm going to revolutionize this industry on the women's side. Mm -hmm. Be the next. I don't like to ever say be the next Charlotte Flair, or the next Becky Lynch. I'm the first Zoe Stark, right? Mm -hmm. So it's exciting. Okay, uh, one last question. Uh, let's see. Uh, so uh, you came from uh, Las Vegas area, uh, Waycott. Uh, where were you trained? Uh, so the future stars of wrestling in Las Vegas. Oh, okay. I started in Salt Lake City, Utah, uh -huh. uh, at a place called UCW Zero. Okay. So that's where I really started my career and where things kind of started taking off. Moved over to Texas for a little bit, trained over there for about a year, year and a half. Mm -hmm. Finally moved to Vegas and started at FSW, and that's when things really started happening for me. Okay. And I said one last question, but let's do another. Oh, yeah, you're good. Uh, so... Uh, you did have that uh, long uh, leg, like layoff. Or yeah, you had that lay, uh, leg layoff. So how do you see like this uh, your WWE tail so far? Uh, how do you feel about that? This like you know like starting up hot, having that long layoff, coming back uh, hot, and now being in a championship match. You know, um, that was probably the hardest time I've ever had. Uh -huh. uh, having to sit out for about eight and a half months and just watching people do what I absolutely love to do. So. It's uh, very exciting to be back and actually now be a part of Stand and Deliver, especially because I wasn't a part of it last year because of that leg injury. Uh, and when, when they when they brought you back, uh, so they did the whole QR code thing. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so uh, what was what uh, what was that like? What uh, made that come to be? Was it what like we're gonna try this out and maybe use it for the White Rabbit S stuff? Or? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I did it first. Yeah. All right. That's here. I did that first. But Bray Wyatt, he made it better. Let's be honest. That was amazing stuff. No, Bray Wyatt didn't do Wordle, though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah. Uh, we got it from a Super Bowl commercial. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not a big football fan myself, but one of the writers, he, he saw it, and he uh, he said, let's do it. Okay. So I just trusted him completely, and it, it worked. That's cool. Awesome. Uh, I think that's it with this interview. It was nice talking to you. Nice talking uh, to you. Have a good uh, match tomorrow. Thank you so much. Have a good awesome. one. Awesome.